Hey, this is John with the Chugach National Forest Avalanche Center. We're up here on the northwest shoulder of Lips at about 2,200 feet. And we stopped just at tree line to dig a pit and see what the snowpack structure is looking like. We also dug a pit down lower, well below tree line at about 1,200 feet. And what we're finding is a bunch of soft new snow on the surface, at least on these northern aspects. On more solar aspects like west and southerly faces, there's a crust on the surface, but on this northwest aspect, the surface snow is still soft. And then about a foot down is the layer that we're concerned about right now. There's a really thin crust, a really thin icy crust from President's Day. That's kind of our main weak layer that we're concerned about right now. All this new snow came in Tuesday night into Wednesday. And we've seen quite a few relatively small avalanches, but they've been staying active longer than a normal kind of storm cycle. So. We're concerned about potential for human triggered avalanches about a foot deep on this layer. Up at higher elevations where there's been more wind uh, on the surface snow, you would find probably a firmer slab on top, which would make this more likely to cause an avalanche. Here, we only got propagation partway across uh, the weak layer. So that's kind of a, a good sign. Maybe the slab is not quite stiff enough to, to make an avalanche at this elevation, but up higher, you might be more likely to find that. So. Definitely something to look out for going into the weekend. Uh, get more information, check out chugachavalanche.org.